Welcome back to Things I Appreciate and Happy New Year, everybody. I just wanted to kick off 2024 with um, a really quick video talking about the concept of self-care. And in my opinion, self-care is not the same as self-indulgence. To me, self-care means doing the things and thinking the thoughts that make you healthier, whether it's physical, mental, social, financial, all those things. And if you're spending too much time in self-indulgence or when you're spending too much time criticizing yourself, you're not spending time moving forward and doing the things that help make you better and healthier and turn you into the person that you want to be and accomplish the goals that you want to accomplish. So basically, you don't want to spend too much time treating yourself or beating yourself up because you get stuck. You're not moving forward in those things. And I don't really have a devil and an angel on each shoulder, you know, whispering to me, but rather I keep in mind future me whispering into my ear whenever I'm going to do something. I want her to be happy, the future me. So I want to do the things that lead to that. I don't want her going, whoa, 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 whoa. Don't do that. It's going to hurt me. Please don't hurt me. Baby, don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. And to make all that happen, it just means moderation. It means self-discipline. To me, going to extremes is not self-disciplined. It's easy to go to extremes. Thing is, extremes are not sustainable. Moderation, moderation, small bites, consistency. It's the concept that really has helped me accomplish all the things I've ever accomplished in life, to be honest, and especially through this last year. So, um, so that's what I'm going to be keeping in mind throughout 2024. And hopefully that'll give you a little inspiration for yourselves as well. So what are your thoughts on that? Do y'all agree? Let me know in the comments below and happy new year. Woo! This is how I burn, burn, pal, got a lot of stuff.